What's happening, Cody? I'm dead. Hi. How are you guys? Good. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. How are you? Good to see you. Uh, today is Thursday, November 10th, episode number 148 of Fast Times at Kroger Fitness. Today we're going to go quick because I got a, another meeting to run to. Um, but hot topic, the uh, our new t-shirts and hoodies are in. Um, what are they? Oh, Anti-Social Social Lifting Club. I was like... That's right. <laughs> How do I say it again? Um, no, no. That was good. They're black and white. They're awesome. Um, if you see them around the gym and you didn't order one, let us know. We are going to do a reorder. Um, if you got a shirt, want a sweatshirt, let us know. We'll make it happen. Um, we'll probably print them at the end of this month. Um, so speak up this week or next week, and we'll get you on the list, and we'll make it happen. Cool? They are. Some of our more popular sweatshirt hoodies that we've ever done. They are pretty awesome. Yeah. Um, couple new members, returning members. Yeah. So um, we have two new members. We have Anna Keller, who's coming from. Um, uh, she's a firefighter, and she's coming from just out of town. Uh, and then we have Brendan Williams, who's from Texas, and he just finished up his intro classes. So you guys will be seeing him. We have another nurse from Stanford. We got a little group of them now. Um, but. Yes, we got two brand new members. We also got two birthdays coming up. We have Spencer's birthday, who is a returning member. He's been crushing. He's been here a lot. I've been at the gym a lot lately. Um, his birthday is today, so happy birthday to him. Woo. And we have Pierce and T's birthday, Teresa, uh, on November 12th. So happy birthday to those two ladies as well. Saturday birthday. I hope you're doing something fun. Yeah. Um, if you didn't notice... Oh, yeah. Ooh, I have this good. awesome mustache going. <laughs> <laughs> I had to shave it for the wedding. I couldn't I couldn't let it ride in the yeah, wedding. Yeah. So I didn't start until, like, Sunday. Um, <laughs> Cody probably would already have what he has by, by uh, f- five uh, days. But, uh, but all I have is basically something you can't even see. This morning I shaved the rest of my face and made the executive decision to give it a roll. So um, if you aren't tuned in, we got our November giving again. Um, Barbells for Boobs and Movember. Um, We're moving for donations. I'm actually going to do the burpees today that I owe. Um, I got PT in a few minutes, and then after that I'm going to fire up some burpees in the gym. Um, So take a look. Get on Movember, Barbells for Boobs, donate some money, watch the coaches uh, do, do the work um, on video or live stream. I'm going to live stream mine on Instagram. So if you're listening to this, you already missed it, but it will be saved. Um, so, yeah, donate some money to some good causes. Um, yep. Let's see. You want to skip to the rolling party real quick? Rolling party. All right, so for our rolling party – um, if you guys haven't seen it up on the board or heard us talk about it, it is Friday, December 9th at 6.30 p.m. Um, we are actually going to cut the 5.30 p.m. so that we can get it all, um, I guess, opened up and set up for you guys. Uh, a rolling party is a little game we play on the rower. If you guys haven't been doing it in the warm-up, you probably will very soon. We've been doing it a lot more lately. Um, but you can bring a friend, a spouse. Um, it works kind of like bowling in the way that we do uh, 10 total frames. Um, you guys bring food and drinks. Um, it's a lot of fun. Wear a nice looking ugly sweater. It's gonna be awesome. This is yes. one of my favorite things every year. So uh, I can't wait to see see it going again. Um, we're gonna skip down a bunch. Our we're gonna go straight to our health tip for the month. It's very simple. Um, just find a habit or a few habits that you can improve during this holiday season when t- people tend to slip. Um, Whether that's drink more water, eat more protein in the morning, um, go to bed 10 minutes earlier, 15 minutes earlier than usual, have one less drink, alcoholic drink than you normally would. Pick something. Pick two things. Just try to be a little bit better. Even if you're not better every single day, if you're better, you know, a couple days a week, um, they will add up and they will help combat the negative stuff that goes on during holiday party season. Um, so build yourself a buffer by doing these positive little things a little at a time um, and get yourself 
set up for success. Yeah. I don't want to go through all the digital high fives, but there is one super important one, so have at it. Uh, we had uh, Mark G get his first ring muscle up, uh, what was that, two days ago. Uh, he's been working on that for a long time, and he finally got it, so congratulations, Mark, for that. that was he really also cool. told me that he deadlifted 405. He did. He also got his first bar muscle up recently, too. I love it. This man's crushing it at the end of the year right now. I love it. Um... We got two celebrity wads coming up. That's right. So programming summary, we're going to uh, skip to next week uh, and just give you guys the, the exciting stuff. Not that all of them aren't exciting. Wednesday, we have Juliana's workout uh, that she um, picked for uh, uh, the wad writing contest. Uh, so Wednesday, you'll get hers. And then on Saturday, we have Carmen's member of the month workout, which is a partner workout. So looking forward to those two things. Those will be next Wednesday and next Saturday. Love it. They're both awesome. Oh, yeah. Um, quote of the week. The impediment to action advances action. What stands in the way becomes the way. Very simply, the best way to get where you're going uh, when you are stuck is through the obstacle. Not around it. Not sweeping it under the rug. Getting it out there, working through it, and moving along. I love that. It's nice. It's pretty good. It is good. Especially with fitness and nutrition and health oh, yeah. and, you know, a lot of other pieces of life. But but it's, it's, real gr it's really good here, right? You can't get a big, bigger deadlift without doing the work to get a bigger deadlift. That's true. Cool. Um, member question this week. What is it? All right. I was thinking about you on this one because you seem like you would travel a decent amount lately. Too much. Uh, Too much. Do you prefer the aisle seat or the window seat? Aisle seat uh, every single time. Ooh. So when I was younger, I think I would have picked the window seat almost every single time. But I think the last five, six years – aisle seat every time it's just so much easier to go to the bathroom you have more leg room you just gotta bring your elbow in when you know the car comes by and that's it bigger shoulders prefer the aisle <laughs> <laughs> it's nice it is um but let us know you know some people just love to sleep on the plane and just sleep on the window is pretty nice but you got something to lean on that's true if you are sleeping on the that window that is one thing that i you know sometimes miss when i sit on the aisle that's true. Yeah. All right, my friend. Good chat with you. Right. That was a Thanks. nice express episode. It was. It was good. We'll chat next week. Yep. All right. All see right. ya.